Hello class, this is Dusty McKenzie at Cabrillo College. I am your archaeology instructor for the semester. It is January 25th, our second full day of class, so I wanted to post this video announcement to provide some additional clarification and direction to help get students started. So hopefully you have seen by now that our class canvas shell is published and fully functioning. So students have access to our homepage, module zero orientation, and our first two learning modules, module one and module two. So if you haven't opened Canvas yet, I recommend you do so as soon as possible and start reviewing the information on the homepage. Proceed to module zero orientation before moving on to module one. Now module one will be open from January 24th to February 6th. This is our first learning module and it contains content pages focused on answering two primary questions. What is archeology span and what isn't archeology? span It also provides some information about some basic archeological concepts, including artifact, ecofact, archeological site, context, and it also discusses the application of the scientific method in our discipline. Students need to be aware that our first graded assignment is due at the end of module one. This is a short essay focused on answering reading questions about an article called How Archaeology Works. This article is embedded in one of the content pages in Canvas, and there's more detailed instruction about the assignment on the assignment page itself. All right, make sure that is uploaded to Canvas on or before midnight on February 6th using a PDF or a Word document only because Canvas can be kind of persnickety and it might not open up other file types. All right, if you have more questions, if you need additional clarification, or if you just wanna stop by and say hello and introduce yourself, we have our first digital office hour of the semester scheduled tonight from 6 to 7 p.m. Um, the link is on the Canvas homepage. All right, so before moving on, I wanted to introduce our artifact of the week. This is Mr. Quackers. It is a replica duck hunting decoy made out of tule reeds. These were made by indigenous hunters uh, throughout the western part of the North America, uh, the western part of North America and they were part of elaborate hunting strategies. When this artifact was originally made, it would have been covered with real life feathers from the duck species that the indigenous hunters were targeting. Not only was it part of these elaborate hunting strategies, but duck decoys like this would have been also important crafts and expressions of you know, artistic values for indigenous peoples. There's one problem with these from an archeological perspective. Because they are made out of organic material, they don't last very long because they're prone to decomposition once they enter the archeological record, AKA the dirt. We'll be learning more about these post-depositional uh, post processes in module one. Anyway, uh, take care and looking forward to meeting you all.